right. At the Crusher Coliseum. He's done this before. <laughs> so you only know. Got a shotgun a boom. A freedom boom. Woo! Check in when you got. Give me one second. Sure, we're just sure, We're gonna play some basketball. Yeah, cool. That's what we do here for most of the time. <laughs> and ping pong. Help yourself. Oh, sweet. Oh. <laughs> Mike knows how to make himself at home. Yo. Yo. How, how are you? What's up? What's, What's you doing? doing? Oh, nice right. to actually meet you. Yeah. Just dropping some business in there. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I just I drop business. Oh. I drop business in here. Yes. Now you're talking about. I thought you were talking about business over there. No, I was, I was, making, I was making a toilet joke. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, I just had a urinate. <laughs> See, nothing about this label ever like jumped out at me or anything like that, but it's, it doesn't seem like a lot. You put it together, it like it slaps. My studies. This is Aaron, by the way. How's it going, Aaron? I'm Mike. Aaron is our. Yeah, I met, I met yeah, you two years ago. Sweet. We got a lot for you guys to try. Yeah, we got we're a lot excited. Of, we got a lot of stuff. Cool. We got pudding. We just approved our electrolytes. I really just wanted sodium and potassium that I could drink, to be honest with you. <laughs> nice. Yeah. But, but you know, you got to sexify it, right? right? Like he, and this is still going to be. A very affordable product. We're gonna do stick packs. We got Blue Valor energy oh, drink here. Oh, cool. Yeah. The the Blue Valor, which you'll taste, was one where we literally first shot, and everyone in the room looked at each other. And was like, this is like, yeah, we're doing this. Did you start a tour here? Or what are you? No, doing? we're just waiting on waiting on you to get done yelling. This is the lobby. This used to be a let's see a grocery store. A fun center, so like laser tag, batting cages, and then um, it was a skating rink. Well, I don't know. No, not skating. Billiard hall. Billiard hall, and then it was a billiards hall. This guy came in here and he put like 50 tables in here, and then like no one showed up. So uh, they were the last tenants that were in here, I think. So we house the four brands here: so Arms Race Nutrition, Core Nutritionals, America Labs, and America Energy. Um, yeah. So the team decided we wanted an open work plan, and here's the thing. We do a ton of business out of here for four different brands, and we run really lean. I mean, you guys know pretty much everyone on our staff, and that's no joke. No company has over 10 employees um, at all, right? Like, so out of all of them, I mean, some of them have two or three. Um, and so everyone does just about everything here. So you guys can see all the samples and stuff that we we're gonna be going through. Um, I mean, we crank through sometimes 40 samples a day. Yeah, because we're doing it for four brands. We have 200 some SKUs already. I mean, it takes a while to get it right. You know? How many days a week are you sampling? I mean, sometimes every day. We sample pretty much whenever they come in. And the nice thing is Dynamics here now. So like, uh, they've been really good at like cranking stuff out for us. You guys will have to sign our wall on the way out. Great. So we had this table. This is like the, our pride and joy here. So we had this custom table made. Beautiful. So this has all our core value coins. Oh, I love it, yeah. So we created challenge coins for each of our core values, and then they built it into the table. So we just got this back in. They did, they killed this. So this needed a lot of work when we got in here. They had to knock down walls and do all that. Uh, the floor was a mess. We did like just polished concrete, which was a massive operation. If we continue to like stack energy drinks here, I think we can do about 700 pallets in this building. Um, and I mean, you can see we're pretty, we can only go three high, but I mean, we're pretty, we're pretty loaded. Literally, this is the arm trace booth. So it's all in here. So that's what it's supposed to be look like. Look like. So like one side's like, a, that's the product display side. And on the other side, it's just like a VIP meet and greet for like the athletes yeah. and Julian and whatnot. Then this is the Crusher Coliseum. It's probably gonna be a little bit loud in here. So this is our pride and joy. Pretty much every piece here is hand-picked. Um, we 
we decided to open it to the public. So right now we probably have about 150 members or so. But one of our core values is build community and be a servant. So people wanted to come, so we kind of told them the deal, like here are the rules, if you want to come. So we do it, we did a little nutrition quarter here. So Okay, guys, so in, so in here, we only carry we only carry our brands in here except for the snacks, because you know all gyms need snacks. So just literally every SKU from our brands are in there. It's actually we're missing some of the swag and stuff up top. So this is Jesse. He's Grizzly Bear Design, so he came and spent a week here. I was gonna ask who did all this. Work. Yeah. So there's his there's his yeah. oh, shout out to him. He's he's cool. He's a military guy. Now he does this for. Like he's just he's definitely an artiste yeah yeah so he just came in he didn't even really have anything sketched or anything he just had some ideas on his phone and he just starts painting and now if we add the dmp okay so you have fury australia stem level you got fury stem level and now you got dmp stem level there's something for everyone or you could take all three for the people that love core in addition to doing these pre-workouts, we're constantly doing other things. So like we have a hair, skin, and nails for a Lifeline. We got a longevity. We have the kids multi. There's constant pudding. We, we got core pudding, pudding coming out. Sperm. 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 We have a lot of other things in the market. So it's not just, we're not just constantly talking about creatine and citrulline. There's just a lot of other cool things you can do. I want to know really what's the origin story of Price Plow. And then I want to get into more the business model, what you guys do, how you serve your clients, and talk about how you have an impact on the supplement industry. I consider Price Plow to be the premier educational media company in the sports supplement industry. Like and that. and we consider Ben, and Ben's obviously a, a pivotal player. He is the bouncer of the industry. All right, Doug, take it away. Arms Race Bar, cereal-based bar. It'll be fully integrated with Julian's love for cereal. This is angled more towards the dark chocolate yeah. side, a little bit more. Yep. Like a Which true I cocoa, like. with a true, like a true cocoa. If someone, yeah, if someone's like more into the super sweet milk chocolate, yep. they might think this is a little bit too yep. harsh for them. But and then this one is uh, Frosted Flake. Can anyone do like a, a Tony the Tiger? They're great. <laughs> <laughs> It, it's, it's, like straight, it's literally like straight but it's not too. So this is, you know, your traditional sludge. Cheers. It's all about the texture with the, the, mm. the sludge. <laughs> so that's one full serving before we bust into it. Yeah. This would be, I haven't had the third one yet. This would be my go-to. This is cookie dough and cream. <laughs> this is not your typical cookie dough. This yeah. is what I'm most excited. This is a, like a so cookie are dough those chocolate chips, or is that that's a, like an Oreo crumb, but with like a a cookie a cookie dough base. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it really feels like there's cookie dough. Yeah. Let's do. Uh, let's do. You want to do? Let's do some stems before yeah. we go to the protein. I, I think one question I have for Doug is: We have all these different samples. How many of these do you expect to actually make it? Oh, we got more over here. This is round one, so these might be all crap. Okay. Yeah. Very lightly, just not too much. Can you get the aromas? <laughs> well, the aroma is actually fantastic. No. That's oh! That's very healthy. Oh! No! <laughs> I'll try that one. Oh, dude. What is that? What was wrong with what is that? that? Here's caramel apple. I feel like Mike's going to like this one. I don't know why. <laughs> Bring it on. I'm going for B. I don't know what that means it's about Mike. He's got a caramel Mike. skin color. It's like, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> He's got that Texan caramel skin color. <laughs> That's our national sales director right there. Ooh, ooh. What is no. this? No. A is no. <laughs> ooh, ooh. It can be a salt water. You talking about Oh, orange mango's the winner. Your mango. You like Lemon, lime, lime, and orange mango. All right, so we had to come to the Mooresville Nutrition Corner. So a big part of what we do is our retail source. So in 2010, so the Core Nutritional started in 2005. In 2010, Doug created Arlington Nutrition Corner, which was our first, first store. What we wanted to do was create a store in our backyard. So we're in here in Iredell County. Our, our uh, HQ was in Statesville. Now we're in Mooresville, introducing the Mooresville Nutrition Corner. So let's go inside. No 
way down. Can we say I love you, buddy? Yeah, I'm Jay with Dynamic Nutraceuticals. Um, so this is our new facility. So do companies, uh, brands ever come up to you and be like, hey, I'm an influencer, I just want to, I want a pre-workout, can you make me one? Like, do you ever get involved in that? And no, we, I don't, we don't really get in uh, formulation or product development as much. We kind of let, we kind of do what we know best. Right, like, okay. Co uh, contract manufacturing, so we kind of let that, the consumer or the client come to us with what they want and then we make it happen. So this is uh, this is kind of the finished product um, without the lighting and everything, but this is called uh, FRP fiberglass. Yeah, I felt that right away. Yeah, so it's smooth FRP. You can wipe these down, you can clean them. Right. You know? It's a clean room. Right. You know? yeah. Then we have a cap salt capper, intercon induction sealer um, to uh, the R Quadro labeler. So right now, we're, our, we don't have a lot of room for our capsule line, so this is going to really help us. We can wheel in pallets of bottles. We can bring in everything we need, and essentially the, the workers don't have to leave. The room is set. Yeah. So the lines are actually going to exit out right here. Oh, nice. And so once once the jar is sealed, you can come out into the open work. Right. You know? Um, so our lines will come out this way. The labeler will probably be somewhere around where Doug's standing. And then in this room, is our AMS uh, auger filler. So that's where the powder is actually getting filled. Okay. Um, and there's a big hopper right here that has a screw feeder, and that's what feeds the auger filler with powder. Mm -hmm. There's a sensor that kicks it on whenever it gets low, feeds it automatically. It's in a game.